We better be quiet. You think so? I think you're full of shit. That's the kind of thing. You better be quiet. What a nut job. Some things need time. Man, I'm still not done with my. Come back. It'll be fine. Trust me. Yeah, I don't understand about anything about working here. We have our way. It should be enough. It's really too late for that now. In the area, too. You're thirsty, aren't you? Shouldn't you be looking after the seedlings? I can wait. Thorhill doesn't see it that way. And that old lady should pay us some real money. We're not screwing around for the hell of it. We know a lot's riding on these seedlings. That's why we're busting our asses looking out for them. But just a couple of shards for all that? Shh. Come on, man. What's wrong with these shards? Not enough of them's what's wrong. If do anything wrong and the bitch cuts our pay. Then just try harder. We bust our asses day and night. Rearing these seedlings ain't easy. Well, maybe for her it is. Been working the field all her damn life. But us? Look at this ragtag bunch. Most of them are from the gutter. That smart-ass attitude of hers doesn't help. Tossing a few shards our way is the least she can do. Is Thorhild the one who decides how many shards you get? I think so. She's so stingy, I bet she doesn't even change her drawers. Hey, couldn't you talk to her? If you can get her to kick in a few more shards for us, we'll get back to work. Promise. Some of these creatures are a real nuisance. Why would he do that? You believe the rumors they left. I'd have approached it differently. <laughs> There's my trusty friend. Well, uh, did you manage... Chloe didn't have your provisions. Seriously? You mean to say you've come back? That's not right! There's not a food shortage. Not exactly. Someone... They were stolen? Oh, for Ravik's sake. The guards were probably too busy harassing me to know... What do I do... I'll make sure Chloe holds up her end of the bargain. I won't ask how you'll manage that, but let me know when... With or without filter? What's the point of a gas mask without a filter? Okay, point taken. I usually have a few in stock. Have a rummage. Because it's you, you can have it for a special low price. Spare me the sales spiel.
Well, who knows what will happen if I don't look after the Bastion. Put your weapon away! <laughs> Who knows what will happen if I don't look after the Bastion? I'm ready if you are. Let's go. How about we go off the beaten track? We can get a good look at what's going on behind the houses, too. Remember, we're not dealing with morons here. They're not gonna come strutting down the main road. Pipe down. There's someone back there. He's mine. Okay. I'll wait here. Just be ready to back me up if he tries to make a break for it. Hey, you! Come over here! Uh, what? Are you talking to me? Don't play dumb. What are you doing back here? I'm just, uh, taking care of some private business. I know you're the one who tried to kill Rat. Don't try to deny it. What? No! Why would I do that? I've been a berserker for six years, and I've never done anything wrong, I swear. Then you won't mind telling me what you're doing here. I... well, the... Thing is, I... ah, fuck it. Okay, I'll come clean. I was uh, just doing my business, you know, taking a leak through the window. You what? Look, the guy who lives here tried it on with my woman. I just wanted to teach him a lesson. Huh? I guess I'd be pretty pissed. Good call. By Ragnar. Thank you. You won't see me again. Well, that was a big hot stream and nothing. And as colorful as it might be, pissing through someone's window isn't quite against the law. Let's forget the whole thing and keep moving. When you gotta go, you gotta go. We'll be watching you! Keep your eyes peeled. Any tiny detail could be significant. that let's take a look I don't know the guy. those two look mighty suspicious don't you think we should get in closer see what they're talking about good idea we should listen in first move in until you're within earshot wait for my signal that's not the story I heard Hey, baby. <laughs> Look, I told you, I'm not interested. Just leave me alone. Somebody sneaking oh, like that on, must be up sugar. to no good. I know you want Quit it. Quit sneaking around. You don't have to I can see you, get. moron. Are you sure? I think we've heard enough. Stop. She you there. What are you doing, asshole? You totally cock-blocked me. Listen to yourself. Got more booze than sense in your head. Take it easy. I, I wasn't gonna do anything to her. I ever see you talking to a woman like that again, I'll slam your face into the ground. And that's if you're lucky. Fuck, man. I get it. I get it. 
Maybe I did have a few too many. Get out of here and sleep it off. And think about what you're doing with your life. Go on, scram! Scumbag like that's always worth keeping an eye on. But as fucked up as that was, it has nothing to do. Let's take a look around the smithy. That's where they got the nails. Can't believe something like that could happen here. You never see that kind of thing in Goliath. hitting on every woman they see. Maybe we'll catch a break and find someone at the blacksmith. We better. After that, I'm out of ideas. At least it hasn't been a total waste. Plenty going on tonight. Just nothing that has anything to do with those flyers. Starting to think we won't find anyone connected to this whole mess tonight. Still. Let's not give up. Sweep's not over yet. Look, over there, right by the smithy. You deal with this one. Go and speak to him. No problem. Good. Just don't stir up any shit if you don't have to. I'll keep watch and make sure he doesn't run. You there! What? What? Are you an outlaw? Are you fucking kidding me? You're not even a pissant guard. I'm not telling you anything. Now get the fuck out of here. Tell me what I want to know. Unless you want me to kick your fucking teeth in. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I like your attitude. Come on then, give me your best shot. Get on with it! You don't pull your punches, do you? Whew. Just tell me what you're doing here. Unless you want another fist in the face. Yeah, yeah, all right, all right. But you're gonna be disappointed. I wasn't trying to steal anything. I was just looking for my smokes. I know I dropped them around here somewhere. I've been sitting in the tavern all night. Come out here for a quick smoke and drop the fucking pack. And that's when you came along. You expect me to believe that crap? Believe what you want. That's what happened. We can kick the shit out of each other as many times as you like, and it won't change anything. I'm no thief. Fine. Just get out of here. No, don't worry. I'm heading right back to Chloe's place and the sweet embrace of about a dozen bottles. Gonna get hammered tonight. <laughs> Another dead end. Let's just finish our sweep and head back to the tavern. You could have helped me there. I knew you could handle him. Besides, I found the pack of smokes he lost. I prefer to think of violence as a last resort. Not sure I would have taken your approach there. Anyway, quit your whining. We should head back. Uh, this isn't gonna be our lucky night. Unless we suddenly stumble over the people we're looking for. I'm starting to lose hope. <laughs> Me too. But you have all the makings of a great berserker. Nice work out there. Anyway, we're nearly there. Seen anything else that looks fishy? Can't say I have. God damn it. Me neither. Uh, 
Well, there's the tavern again. Think I'll go in and soak up some of the atmosphere. Ask around. Maybe I'll hear something. That's about all we can do. The whole night was a waste of time. You giving up? Maybe. I don't know. We should split up for now anyway. Maybe we'll have more luck that way. Other than that, I'm all out of ideas. Anyway, let me know if you see or hear anything that seems even slightly relevant. Anything. Right then. See you later. You better be quiet. They should feel shame. It had to happen. No point dwelling on it. Too many ears listening. Whatever you want to Beer. tell me is probably unconvincing. Well, you're a barrel of laughs this evening. Oh, yeah. I'm all smiles. Want to talk about it? Ah, just a shitty assignment from a rat, that's all. But who cares, right? As long as there's beer. Hey, you're the customer. But you know where to find me if you want to have a real talk. Thanks, Chloe. Appreciate it. We have our way, which should be enough. Ugly, ugly situation. Anyone who says so is a damn idiot. Don't ask me what this is about. They should feel shame. Holy shit. No one wants to hear my opinion. Can't make it any oh. Exactly what was he thinking? I heard things in a besser, Dyer. Not now, I'm busy. Shit pay. Apparently, they're still in bullets. <sighs> Let's keep going. you find out I'll start okay no research is my job 
I'm starting, Petra. I agree with Bobby's argument. Killjoy. Two people must have drunk a lot of beer in front of the tavern. Then, when they were finished, they went somewhere else. Two people, you say? That fits my current hypothesis. Perhaps the same two people that had a fight in the healer district. But only one person was spying in the residential district. Only one? Intriguing. Why is that inter... interesting? My friends, we can now deduce the following. Two acquaintances meet in Chloe's bar. They get drunk together, and then they change locations. The healer district. Precisely, Petra. Precisely. A dispute arises. The dispute becomes an altercation. As with many altercations, there is a winner and a loser. The You're loser is angry, around. naturally. He is our suspect, who in his peak, vandalized Hitch's home. And left us to take the blame. Do you know what that means? We got means? back problems. Go on, tell us. We have a new got case. Back problems. Really, just the same old case. You got back a problems. A trivial detail. Now let us proceed as follows. Bobby, your job is to find out who Hitch was in the bar with last. Got it, boss. Petra, you maintain your vigilant surveillance of the residential district. All right. And what are you going to do? My aunt wants me to clean up this junk. I'm afraid I can't get out of it. You have two days to get the information we need. Good luck. You can stop sneaking around. I saw you. So, how's your case going? I am not at liberty to share our progress with you. You must be able to tell me something. I'm sorry. Every single detail is strictly confidential. Then I'd better leave you to it. Yes, you had. I have the gas masks that Scrappy needs. He asked me to bring them to him. gas masks you need you got them Seri fuck me son here ain't got a damn clue how I can thank you ah you know what take more of that
Find the cultivators? Yeah. Butch told me they wanted more shards. Ungrateful curs. Is my training worth nothing to them? They don't think much of that either. And they still want more shards? Unacceptable! Surely you can spare a little, Alexit. You've no doubt noticed that more seedlings has meant more cultivators. A little soon turns into a great many. But Fenris isn't allocating me more funds. So, I have to make do with the budget I have. You see? My options are limited. Or do you have a solution already? I'll talk to Fenris about payments for the cultivators. I bet he won't cough up a single shard. You'll see. Thorhild says you'll divide up the shards, right? I suppose. Can't say I'm looking forward to it. Everyone feels like they've been shortchanged and wants more. The cultivators, for example. Ah, so that's why you came to see me. And no, I cannot give Thorhild more shards. I'd have to withhold some from the paladins if I did, and Scrappy is already underpaid. Talk to Tylus. If he'd be willing to forego his shares of the shards, I might be able to make something work. I need a few shards for the cultivators. Could you spare any? Listen here, young man. You're getting rather presumptuous. It's urgent. Thorhill's workers are running away. Okay, well, in that case, ask my assistant. If anyone around here could spare some, it's that scoundrel Rake, not me. I'm pretty tired of you lot passing the buck all the time. Oh, so I'm not the only one you've asked. Well, don't expect me to be any different from the others. I do the work of two people and rarely catch... Even my patience has its limits. I'll... The property of an alchemist must not be mis... Okay. I've just told you. You know, I thought motivating him with shards was a good idea. It does mean, however, he's got shot. And you... He simply won't listen. He's totally overpaid. More than most workers would dream... He'll be reluctant. Of course. I'd be glad to see the back... Anyway, head to the tavern. Now.
Bill's shame. I heard he was wrong. Something he told. Man, I'm still not. Then drink faster. We have to talk. Oh yeah. The cultivators want more shot. Ah, I understand completely. Oh, wait, no, that's bullshit. What's it got to do with me? You're supposed to give up part of your pay for them. <laughs> Sounds real appealing. Bet Tyler's put that... Does it matter? Man, they really pull the wool over your eye. Listen. Tell you what, just a little proof that you'll like my solution. Don't want to blow my own trumpet, but I'm pretty well known for coming. Those idiots should have sent you to me right away. Listen up, man. Gotta call in a few favors. Then you'll get what the cultivators want, all right? But first, I need some food to get the gray matter going. Well. Whatever you want to tell me is probably unconvincing. Learn some patience. This food leaves much to be desired. You better be quiet. Someone told me the whole troop was killed. Yeah. You think so? Hmm. It's time. I don't believe it. Ah, the man of the hour. Right on time, too. Listen, I found the solution to your little cultivator problem. But I don't want anyone overhearing our little plan. This is for your ears only. Follow me, okay? Few more steps. Then you'll see. Apparently they're still in Goliath. Hello, friend. So, you're the guy after Rake's money. That's right. Then you're not gonna like what happens next. Go on, kick the shit out of him. You heard the man. Nothing personal. Don't forget that asshole still has my shards. Got it. Now get lost. I'll take care of it. Don't worry, little man. 
you won't feel a thing. Best if you don't put up a fight. <laughs> Same again! Come on, hit him! <laughs> So, then you're not... Why is nothing happening? So, Rake's up next. Oh, I think I broke something. Oh, what? Here to make fun of me? Working for Rake. I'm a mercenary. Although, I guess I won't be getting paid. Do me a favor. It's his fault this happened to me. Bet he's hiding close by. I'm out of here. Careful with that weapon. What the hell are you doing here? You should have found a better fighter. Oh, oh look, man. Uh, that was just... D tell Tylus you can have my shards. Can't let... Oh, f In fact, I'm... Drake can be crossed off the... Get mirror. control of you. I should tell Thorhilden. Get control of yourself, will ya? Get control of yourself, will ya? Get control of yourself. I have nothing to say to criminals like you.
nothing happening. <laughs> Take it way too long. Same again. Attack. So, Rake's up next. You get away with this. Oh, fuck! It if Ray can be crossed off the payroll, I should tell Thorhild and Tylus. <laughs> <laughs> Rake's gone. Damn! That little shit still needs to clean out the charcoal retorts! He's turned his back on the fort. In truth, I won't miss him much. His antics got on my nerves. I'm glad that's the end of it. Tell Thorhild that she can have his shards. Okay, thanks for letting me know. We'll pick up anything else we need along the way. All right. Let me guess. You couldn't negotiate. Quite. Well then, I'm. Tylus's aide informed me he's going to donate his salary. What? Is nobody said it was by choice. Uh. So. Maybe the shards will finally make. You can tell Butch that the. Co I expect. really 
think so? Hey, I have to talk to you. Not here, though. Meet me next to the entrance to the upper district, okay? Tonight, midnight. What do you want from me? No, 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 no not now. Not here. Just remember, midnight... I'll explain everything then. My way, and there's the wrong way. Party took the whole troop. The cult of see for yourself. You're serious. What do you think it'll take to get her to treat us like human beings? Any chance you could help with that? I mean, your let me think. That Apparently, they live underground. It had to happen. No point dwelling on it. Ugly, ugly situation. I know. Apparently, they're still in Goliath. This must be a joke. I don't believe it. I feel sorry for it. Was that gonna follow us come on the crater is waiting well okay hey buddy I can uh thanks man you're well uh, I've got I really Good. There's still one more thing I could. You've never given the impression that. You don't say. That's why. I... I've got some. Something's telling me the shards won't keep the cult of. I'm not surprised. But how? They even have. You ever tried listening to them? Why? Their role here is clear. I've explained what they have to do more than once. Did you also show them? No. Why would I demonstrate what I've already explained? Have you ever praised their work? I haven't needed to. Do you show your workers the same respect you show your seedlings? Not really. I guess. That's what I thought. I'm starting to understand what you're trying to say. I think I know what has to be done. You've given me a lot to think about. Thanks. Did you want to know anything else? Not right now. I'll report to Fenris that you've been a big help. Now, please excuse me. There's some things I need to... explain. Wait a minute. Listen up. I'm aware that I might have been not that fair to you recently. Recently? <laughs> Try never. <clears throat> well, I'm going to try to do things differently from now on. 
I'll support you to the best of my abilities. And if you have any questions, just ask. Does that mean we don't have to work nights anymore? Yes. Get some rest. You'll need it. Together, we're going to raise these seedlings to true greatness. World hearts to bring real change to this world. Yes, ma'am. Never forget how important what we're doing is. To a successful harvest! Whoa. The old woman's a totally different person now. That's more like it. I can't believe it. Hey, let's... Let's take... More recruit. There was an incident. It wouldn't be the first. I have to put up a notice here. And you think I'll just... Without the mine, the fort... And without seedlings, we... Is there any... No. And I... But that's not to say I won't help you reach a comp... You have one day to give me a reason... If I don't hear from you by then, scrap. Shards can't replace... But you could bring in a new one. Scrappy. But he needs people right now. And if you brought in new recruits... You're stubborn. Let me... Man. Good.
another guy. Not yet. Meet me at midnight tonight. Uh, just forget it. You didn't deserve that. Then you better keep doing it yourself. going to happen to me. Come out here, bastard. Make it easier on yourself. Show yourself, coward. Hmm. Huh. Not who I was expecting. Looking for someone? Yes. Well, then that makes two of us. One too many. Maybe we're looking for the same person. And? Well, he's a berserker. About your size. Fast. Ring any bells? Pretty vague description. His name's Marwin. He wants to get to the fort, but I'm not gonna let him. You seem pretty determined. I don't like to fuck around. What did Marwin do to you? To me? Nothing. But that's irrelevant. I know he's supposed to work with the alchemists in the fort. Yeah. It's my job to get him there safely. Hmm, so you're the errand boy. Giving the job to a clueless imbecile. Sounds like something the fort would do. Watch it. Maybe I should explain. The alchemist's elixirs heal wounds, improve a warrior's strength, that sort of thing. It's an advantage that means they're stronger than other factions. Well, Baxter's had enough. What's that got to do with Marwin? Not a lot. He's just a pawn. When I've seen to it that he won't make it to the fort, I'll take his place. I don't like what you're planning. Listen, what do you think's gonna happen when the Purple Sky Plague's been eradicated? The Berserkers will... They'll keep fighting. They must be stopped. It's... Our boss understands. He had... His escort's been taken care of, but... Listen. If you spot... And... The raptor... So... I don't kill for sport. It's necessity. The outlaws can't, I assure... Plus, my future's based on the... Disobeying Baxter's orders is a one-way ticket to a great... Tell me... Join me.
Listen, you're doing the right thing. Right. I'll look here, you... I doubt he's managed to find it. Oh, and one other thing. Vision. There are beasts ever almost got me. Oh wait. You're Tyler's Oh wow. It's good to meet you. But me come My hiding place isn't far from here. Keep your eyes open. The silence is deceptive. Okay, this is better. I'm sorry about the smell. Finding a safe place to answer nature's call, well, it's not easy. How long have you been hiding out here? A uh, few days, I suppose. Maybe longer. It's not by choice. I should be at the fort. But Tylus must have forgotten about me. But you were stopped. Right. It's not just those creatures that are out. My guides were shot by some bastard outlaw. A whole troop left Goliath, but I'm the only one left. I guess he wanted me dead too. But I got away. He's still out there, waiting, while I'm stuck here using up all my supplies. I'm mad. And what did he? He wants to take your place as the. He wants to kill me. Totally serious. So what? You won't. Lights out for you!
You won't... Ex... Pity he'll never know how great a purpose he served. What are you gonna... I'm going to the fort. Dress like that. Good point. Hmm, a little tight, but at least one of Marwin's escorts was more my side. Feel free to search Marwin's corpse if you... Berserkers usually... It's of no interest to me, and I have to show my appreciation. Well, I'll... Hold on a sec. Tylus was asking about you. You better go talk to him soon. Anything? He said you should kick over a few shards for this info. What? Yeah. Hmm. So cough up some shards. I'll bring them to Fenris later. Shit. The community is grateful. Get out of here. I know who you're talking about. Well, can't you see I'm... T I'm not getting the impression that alchemy is your forte. Here, old man. Hmm. Looks like I'll have to teach you some manners as well as the first steps. But that's fine. Take a look around. Familiarize yourself with everything. Training will begin tomorrow. I want you to know I couldn't have done it without... My boss gave me something for the job. You earned it. Thanks. I've made sure that... I expect you wish it was you. Ask him yourself. Hmm. Huh. It's the apprentice who does the asking. But thank you for finding him for me. I think you're forgetting something. Heaven help me. I need some shards. I'll tell Fen... There. <laughs> now, I must... Want to buy something? What's got you? Oh, nothing personal. I buy a lot of my stock from him. I think his ways are starting to rub off. I didn't mean to be rude. Take a look around. Doesn't everyone have a... Of course. Then you shouldn't stop me from putting... And what if people start... If they don't want to work here, they won't... Hmm, might be onto something there. Put up your notice. No one will be interested. Who'd work in a musty mine shaft?
done. I should get back to Scrappy. Did Thorhill give you permission? Yeah. Oh, okay. Good job. Here's a little something. For you. You're a good one, you. Shit on a plate and call it quizzy. This mine will be. I'll make sure. Fa Thanks again, boy. Now I'm off to get my new workers to. You need anything else? Well, Scrappy see Thorhild seems satisfied, and Tylus says you really helped him. Right, now you have an ad. For that, you'll have to pass rap. I should warn you, so don't. Your confidence is, but as you know, this is the former outlaw camp. But not all of them hold us berserkers. In have you noticed the outlaw propaganda? Yeah. Ah, I see. I was going to send you. Help him find the source of... If you manage... If you think you can steal from here, you're sorely mistaken. Stink just like a pig, she said. Now I stay clear of women better that way. So I just swing my hammer off. Before you say anything. Doing what? I'm investigating. Do you want to know what I'm looking Well, I'm. That still wasn't everything.
Okay, this'll do. We can talk here. What's with all this secrecy? Listen, you're drawing a lot of attention to yourself. Running through the camp, accusing everyone of working with the outlaws. It's not exactly subtle. So do the business. You're looking for the outlaws responsible for that propaganda. Am I right? Go on. <laughs> oh, are you barking up the wrong tree, pal? The Claws aren't outlaws, but we're, uh, sympathetic to their cause. You're on the path to winning the Berserker's trust. And I have an offer for you. What are the Claws? Uh, then all in good time. You'll see soon enough. Just listen to my offer, okay? What exactly are you offering? I want you to work for us. Don't worry, it won't involve bloodshed. We Claws prefer a more subtle approach. We want you to cozy up to the Berserkers. Pass us any information you find out. But we'll pay well. A lot of shards to be earned. And just to show we're serious, here's a small advance. Plenty more where that came from. <laughs> Trust me. Think about it, alright? If you'll join us, meet me in my kitchen. If not, well, we never had this meeting, understand? Just don't take too long making up your mind. think you decide so quickly. Glad to have you aboard. Okay, listen up. Before I take you to our hideout and make introductions, I need something. I need evidence that I can trust you. Like what? I need you to, uh, <laughs> get your hands dirty. We need to know you're prepared to take risks for us and have some thieving skills. No problem. I want you to steal a ring. Just a ring? Well, no, 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 not just any old ring. It's a valuable piece that belongs to a wealthy trader who lives in the upper district. He won't miss it. How do I get it? Oh, well, shouldn't be a problem. You see, as a cook, I have access to the upper district. I collect the ingredients from my kitchen there. I know this traitor has a secret entrance into his house. A kind of escape route. That is your way in. There's a device on the outside of his house that'll open the path for you. It should be simple. At night, access the secret entrance, sneak into the house, and steal the traitor's signet ring. Got it? Come and see me when you're done. Oh, uh, <laughs> nearly forgot. The device needs a key. Lucky for you, I already made a copy without him noticing. Lucky indeed. Oh, we Claws like to be well prepared. Okay, well I'm out. See you then. Luck. See you when the job's done. Stop! You're not coming!
Skinny's keys seem to work. Doors open. didn't work. No, just can't do that yet. Got it. I should take the ring to Skinny. Should probably lock it again. Fantastic, but it's not for me. This ring's your ticket into our world, so uh, keep it for now. By the way, you did... What do you think? <laughs> I didn't think it was. You'll make a fine... Now, uh... Where are we going? Uh, no questions, just follow me. I'll show you the door, but, uh, you have to go through it alone. Claws work solo, see, that's how it works. Nobody knows I tested you. So she has a last word. If she thinks you're trustworthy, well, my friend, you are in. Listen, pal, I hate this vague bullshit. Who's she? I said no questions, didn't I? Just be patient. You'll see soon enough. Almost there. This is your hiding place? This? <laughs> of course not. See the trap door there on the floor? Now let me unlock it for you. Okay, it's all yours. In you go. Just don't forget to close the tunnel back up when you leave. See you around. Hopefully. Wait, aren't you coming? Nope. You have to do this alone. Good luck. Aha, uh -huh. there we go. Open. Should probably...
Welcome to the underground. No, just can't do that yet. That didn't work. I'm Yasma, but before you say a word, I have to get this out. I don't want to know who you are. I don't want to know your name, and I don't care where you came from. Remember that, and we'll get along just fine. Haven't we met before? I don't know, and I don't care either. The Claws tend to disappear and never come back. They join other factions or end up dead. I've lost too many people I cared about. So I don't have any friends. And I don't care to make any. You don't seem surprised to see me. You being here means someone from the Claws vouched for you and showed you where our hideout is. You're not just here for your health. You've proven yourself to earn your place here. So what happens now? Well, if you're here, you would have had orders to steal something, right? Whatever that is, give it to me. Skinny said I could keep the ring. Right up until I asked for it. This ring is insurance. It has your fingerprints on it. That means if you blow our cover, you'll be going down with us. Now hand it over. No, I'm keeping the ring. I want you to think very carefully about your next words. I already told you why we need it. Without it, we can't trust you. If we can't trust you, you're not welcome here. If you don't give me the ring... I don't... Looks like Skinny made a mistake. He would have been an asset to the Alp. I'll get him! Good. Don't worry. We wouldn't want anyone to find it with your fingerprints on it. Now. I'm here to earn some shard. That, I'd believe. But it's still not... Skinny. You wouldn't be here if you hadn't followed him of your own belief. I want to join. That may be. I'm disappointed. I know Wolf sent you to take down. You. Of course. No. If you knew that. I arranged this little test and sent Skinny to administer it. To show you I trust you, you can leave again. When we get to know each other, they're proof that you. We've set up some old ruins near the fort to make it look. Take these leaflets to Wolf.
Don't worry. We I was sent by the Berserker. It takes a brave man to sneak into a monster's lair. I was... You knew... Of course. If you knew... To show... When we get to know it, take the... Propaganda leaflets. They're proof that you... We've set up some old ruins near the fort to make it look like our... Take these leaflets to Wolf. Tell him you found our camp. Then send him over to the decoy in the ruin. Do that, then it'll take the heat off us for a while. Then I'll answer all your questions. Please. Welcome to the Sleepy Travel. We rent our room. 70 shards a week. No breakfast. I don't have time right now. Finally! Don't you dare hey. do that again! Now you get it. Don't make me angry. We have a problem. I heard that. Uh, let's see, what can I palm off on? I mean, what can I... What a question, my friend. I only stock the most... Since Skinny opened that soup kitchen and, and that Morcon trader who's made himself. I wish the city watch would stay. Now, nah, but what can you do? What about it? I heard you shouldn't mess with him. You all got your masks on already. That's good. A few things you gotta know before we get started. Come on, come closer. Don't make an old man holler. That's better. Right. Where are you hiding from? You'll need something to eat, sleep, fight with, and take the edge off. Last one's optional, I guess. Tools are already down there. And just don't forget, the mine's chock full of gas. So change your filters out often, okay? All right, let's go then.
Sisso's a damn idiot. the kind of thing I you're absolutely sure <laughs> those old ruins just outside the fort looks like they've already abandoned it but I found these propaganda materials lying around that's it they didn't leave any other clues not that I saw Damn it all! They slipped through our fingers and... I think I know the ruins you mean. It looked like they left in a hurry. Probably some time ago. Well, we already knew these people were smart. It seems they stopped their propaganda operation a while back. It's not like we can keep the upper district... I'll talk to Fenris and tell him we should give back access to any... Ah, but listen to me babbling about protocol. This is a good day. We can finally put this whole business. Here's part of the bounty. We Why only? Well, you did find their hideout, but not the actual people respond. But hey, this is still a time to celebrate. What do I care? Can I? Well, you have at least one advocate. I'm a... You officially have my. You're the first person I can send up there with a clear. He's going to want to talk to you. He's... I'm sure when he hears what you have done, I'll see you around. I have something. Go to the upper district and tell the gate. You'll be able to. Stop. The upper part of... You're not coming in. Fenris gave me his personal permission. Getting rid of the outlaws. That was... Some guy just told me you gave him permission to enter the upper district. Thought we weren't letting civilians up here no more. Thank you for coming to me about this, but he speaks the truth. I did give him permission. 
He and Wolf found the outlaws who were distributing flyers around the camp. Huh, is that right? Well, I guess that's something. That mean anyone can go up there now? No, only people on the list can enter. Anyone else needs an advocate. Right, got it. I'll head back to my post then. You can come in. I see the guards have eaten. Mm, I don't like it, but I guess I. So, the warehouse. Nothing here. I don't run a storefront. I don't know you, so it's none of your business. Just so you know, there's one thing I. A well stocked. But some. So I'd appreciate. A stickler f Sure, I could do that. Don't worry. Well, I'm not teaching you. So, I'm going... If one and a half raptors eat one and a half beggar corpses in one and a half days... How many beggar corpses does a raptor eat in one day? One and a half raptors? There's no such thing. That's not the point! This is about numbers, not biological accuracy! Just use... Given these conditions, one raptor would eat just one beggar corpse in one and a half days. Consequently, if we calculate how much it would eat in one day based on that, we end up with two-thirds. Simple! Ah... Well, given your complete inability... Go, but you. But enough, child. Just let me know when you. Hmm. I mean, some heathen. Way. It's. Stupid. 
You're gonna have to have a new one, man. I'll spare this. If I've been robbed, then my warehouse might be next. Demand-oriented supply. Special ra This place will fall into... And what do they do about this? They ease... Only, can, if I tell you, can you, hmm, you're a bit, so we're, what I'm going to show you is very sensitive. You give me some shards that cover any possible, you'll get them back later. Of what? Do you remember me saying that I don't hand out anything from, well, help me. You'll also get to buy from the warehouse. <laughs> it's up to you. Excellent. Oh, this theft problem is going to take some time. When you have the time... Mm. Only you'll be the thief. Everything... <laughs> The law of averages says things are going to start disappearing. It doesn't take a G. But since we don't know the exact time... What's the pr- If other upper district citizens are robbed too, then they'll all realize that we need to change the security rules. Then, Rat won't be able to refuse. So, the sooner that happens... It's not just the Sneak into the guard's dorm and see... Only take what's valuable. Why? So, you're just going to return whatever val... Hmm, that's the plan. But I still need to figure out how I... Keep an eye out for little pouches with shards. You may not... F After all, not many people are... Uh, uh, don't come back until you've got... What do you...